Hello everybody, this is Money Mom. Welcome back to the channel. I want to talk to you guys about the things I do by Christmas edition. Let's get started. The first three all kind of go together. I do send out Christmas cards. And the reason being is because I have a large extended family. And I also have old college roommates and, you know, old friends from all different areas. Many live in all the different states so we send out cards and letters to keep in touch with each other throughout the year. And I sure enjoy that, especially seeing updated family photos. So number one, stamps, because I do need more stamps at this time of year. Number two, cards. That's a Christmas card that I usually send. And many times I'll get that on clearance after the Christmas season. Number three, we usually write up a Christmas letter. And what I usually do is I go have that printed off at a office supply store and so that's something else we do and also and I put this as number eight but I'll just say it now I also sometimes do a picture or send some pictures along some years I do some I don't each year could be a little bit different so number four baking ingredients I love to bake and many people like my homemade cookies and I enjoy giving them as a gift number five lights my husband does a beautiful outdoor light display and he really enjoys decorating for Christmas and we do buy them on clearance after the season but sometimes they don't last lights don't last all the time so we do have to replace them so we do sometimes have to buy lights number six presents and I want to tell you guys something about this I have to be honest and say I hear all these wonderful youtubers that are so creative with their gift ideas I am probably the most boring gift giver you would ever meet in your life. The, I want to know exactly some choices and what to get you if I am going to exchange with you. And I'm going to give you an example. One of my friends and I are actually going to go, and we'll probably wait till the beginning of January, because we're going to go bra shopping and get fitted for a bra. And I told her, I'm, and basically she's thrilled, I'm buying her a bra for Christmas. I know that sounds like a really lame Christmas gift, but that's what she wants. And I'm giving her something that she wants instead of like, you know, and there's nothing wrong with any of these other gifts. But many times, if you think about the minimalist movement, many times people receive things from wonderful people that are so giving and thoughtful, but sometimes people are trying to maybe downsize some of the items they have. So I'm really mindful of what to give my friends because I want to make sure it's something that they're really interested in having and that they're going to use. So I wanted to share that. So I do love giving gifts, but I like knowing exactly what people like and what is going to be useful to them because that is very, very important to me. So my gift giving is not always a surprise, as you would say. The other thing that I like to do or pay for sometimes are Christmas activities. We may be going to a uh, light show that is in the DFW area and you are in a car and you go through and you see uh, wonderful light displays and I know that you pay per car load. I've actually not done that yet, but that may be something I'm doing this year. But I do enjoy sometimes going to a Christmas play Christmas movie that to me in paying for experiences is for me more fun than actually receiving gifts because it's something that's a memory that I can always hold on to so these are some of the things that I love to spend money on and one of the things that I'm really loving this year is I picked up the product demonstrations so I actually have some Christmas fun money to be able to splurge a little bit if I want so I want to know if you do celebrate Christmas and you do like to spend a little money, what are some things you like to spend money on at Christmas time? This is Money Mom signing off, and as always, I love you. Bye-bye.